Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ms. Roxanne. This is Daddy Rambles. Today we're going to be going over The Flash and we're doing Season 1, Episode 5. And the episode is called Plastique. So we start off with Barry can't get drunk. He's at a bar and he sees Eddie and Iris being all lovey dovey, so he wants to drink and he can't get drunk. And uh, he he's just pining over Iris. Like, it's almost kind of sad. And then we cut to someone is breaking into a building and took a file. And then um, the person uh, grabs her backpack and the person touches it and it, it explodes. And um, it there's a bunch of people in this grappling hook, so he has to rescue his people. So he actually very runs up the building and rescues the people. And then um, Iris is there and she sees the flash, and but she calls him the streak, which is so lame. Um, but Barry kind of covers his face and he runs off. He vibrates his face really fast so you can't see it. And then um, Barry finds the file that was missing um, because of the, um, the super speaker and the CSI. Then I, can, I cannot remember this guy's name, General Eiling or Illing or. Anyway, it's his freaking intro. <laughs> and um, he demands all the info on the case be turned over, but um, Barry kept one file. And then the Flash found the girl, and um, she accidentally caught his um, suit. <laughs> and he had to get out of super super quick for it exploded. And then um, I just did some digging on the Flash or the streak or whatever. Um, then Barry tells her to stop, and our sister says, shut it, I'm doing it anyway, suck it. <laughs> then the army shows up to where, um, to where, um, the girl is, and then, um, Barry rescues her, and Cisco uh, hits on her, like, real hard. <laughs> He's got a mad crush on her. Then they find a freaking tracker on her. So um, the army shows up at Star Labs and then um, they were testing her abilities when the dark matter and the particle server exploded. So that's how she got her powers and stuff. And then the Flash talks to her and um, the Flash yeah, talks to her but he changes his voice and blocks his face out. And then they, carry, um, then they help her out and they can't reverse her DNA as permanent because she doesn't want these powers, period. So she's just like, I don't want to do something about it. But they, there's something they can do about that. So it's kind of sad. And then Joe and Barry talk about Iris. And um, Joe knows that Barry ha uh, has a crush on her. It's like painfully obvious to everybody else. But to him, well, except for Iris. <laughs> Which is it's just a funny moment because he's like, "Why, ow!" And then uh, Wells and Plastic talk and tells her to stop and kill Eiling, and says, "Like, gear up, soldier, and do your duty." So this, then it's the army versus Plastic, and then Eiling ends up killing her, or she starts to, um, starting to go. Um, so he kills her, and but um, the army guy sees see Barry's face because he took off his mask, which I don't understand why he did that, but he did. And then she starts to literally starts to blow up, and she starts to glow, and she's basically a bomb now. So he has to run on water, and literally just drops her far away from Central City because if it stayed there, it would have blown up the entire city. So he just escapes the flood, and the army covers it up, saying it's just a test, and that's worked, I guess, whatever. So they carry um, same way, they covered it up. Then Iris and Barry talk, and um, and then about again about the blogging thing, and Iris won't stop blogging. She just want to do it if it kills her. And so then Barry says, "Look, I need a break from you." So. We just need to start stop talking for a while, so they end up they go their separate ways for a little bit, and then um, so they go to another bar. Um, Team Flash goes to another bar, and Caitlin literally gives him a five hundred proof alcohol, 
And it works at first, then it wears off super quick. And then Iris, then we cut to Iris is crying, and then um, about everything that's happening with between her and Barry and stuff. And then Wells and Eileen talk, and Wells threatens him, and vice versa. And then we have a flashback to Garod, the ape, or gorilla, the other main mammal thing. So anyway, uh, that's that episode. So that was a pretty freaking good episode. I really liked it. Um, you have Will being really, really shady. I've already seen the series, and I'm rewatching this play for the third time. It's still kind of shocking about Will how shady Wells is in this. So I really do like the character development going on so far. We've learned a bunch of new things. So um, I like the character development happening in this, and you know, how strong willed um, Iris is, and how she's willing to put stuff on the line to uh, get the truth out, and all this type of stuff. So I really do like that. And Barry's still learning his powers. I do like the progression to how that's going. So everything's going pretty good. So I'll give this an A plus episode. It was really good. And that's going to do it for me. So if you like this video, if you like this um, review of this of the TV show Flash. Please comment down below on what you think of it and like it and subscribe for more stuff because I'll be rolling out a lot more videos soon. So this music, this both music and TV. And so um, have an awesome day. I'll see you in my next video. Bye, everybody.